Well, hello everybody, Smith here, and welcome back to another Sonorama update. Yes, guys, a new update has been done, and we've got quite a few creatures to show you. If you remember the last update, if you watched it, we had the bird update, uh, and we had some other creatures as well. This was our original world that we spawned everything into, and uh, as a suggestion uh, from Red Cooper, who makes this wonderful mod, uh, Red Cooper suggested, why don't we go and have a look at the new Badlands or updated Badlands and Desert and showcase the new animals there because there's those sandy blocks uh, behind my head there which will be shown off in the Badlands and the Desert. So we're going to do that. I just thought we'd come here first just to show some of the creatures that spawn around. Uh, all the creatures spawn in different parts of Desert uh, and Badlands biomes as you will see. Uh, so it's available for Minecraft 1.16.5 and Forge. And uh, yeah, we've got some plants. We've got a new plant as well. So we're going to show you the new plant, how it spawns naturally in the world. Uh, many of the creatures have different uh, different skins, like these two prairie. Are they the prairie dogs? They've got two different skins there. So they have lots of different skins. So it's a, it's a fun mod and it works really well. Right, so we're going to head over to our new world, guys, and show you the new stuff. So we're over here in the Badlands, guys, and the new plant we have is called a chestnut uh, sci, sci sad sapling. It comes with a chestnut cycle of leaves and also sci sad trunk. Uh, and you notice behind me, guys, you can see the uh, stony sand spawning there. Yeah, so you can see here down here, the spawny sand, spawny sand, I call it the stony sand, uh, just literally spawns in the golden sand here and in the desert edges, we'll go to a desert in a minute, but what you'll find is this area usually has deserts running around the outside and we'll see the other plants there. But you can notice that some of the old plants already spawn here, like this one here, the Mojave Yucca. Uh, and some of the other plants. I think this is one as well, isn't it? Yeah, this is a grand cat's eye. Uh, not all of them here are Sonorana, but we have some beautiful stuff. So it just wanted to show you how the stuff spawned in and sort of made the Badlands a bit brighter and a bit more fun. Uh, the idea of the blocks is, oh, we'll go to the sand in a minute, but we'll show you anyway. The idea of the blocks, guys, is decorative purposes because they are different. Uh, look, the different patterns, and I can probably make that go there. Yeah, different patterns. And yeah, let me just do that. That might be a different pattern that way. Yeah, so they have different patterns, so you can use them how you wish, like that. See, that, that one did different. That didn't. Ah, so we can make them all the same, like that. And I think it's the same if I bring these, like so. I think you'll see four different patterns on there although two and two or maybe that sort of spun round that's the same there isn't it so there we go those are the decorative blocks and again it depends which way you put them in oh they did they see that spawn differently interestingly oh yeah why did that do that oh there we go so you can use them as stone blocks as well so there we go to match the other blocks Right, okay, so we'll head to the desert because we can show you these off. Just wanted to show you the Badlands first and how that changed with all the plants. And you can see these sites spawn quite regularly across the top of the Badlands. So let's go to the desert. Right, so here's the desert. Again, you can dig this stuff up. Oh, there's a live creature spawned in the desert here. It's a bobcat. One of those two bobcats. Oh, wow. <laughs> next i love the way how ice spawns next to the and you get bobcats and polar bears in the same area oh what's that it's that little oh, that's just a normal poppy growing in the desert which is quite interesting so uh let's show you these plants that spawn over here well they do they do spawn because I've, I've seen a load of them and now i can't find them as usual ah here we go guys no the these as these are found here look spawning at the edge this is quite good i think this will be good to spawn in the you look at them spawning in the savannah here as well oh they spawn across the savannah oh that is brilliant that is really cool that they spawn in the savannah i like that or maybe that because the savannah's next to a desert here but yes i like that that brightens up our savannas uh, but what i found is where the little desert runs around the badlands you'll find those uh, plants spawn in there. So, but you can actually get the blocks, so you can actually build them yourself. 
Uh, now, uh, is that the leaves? Yeah, there we go. We could actually. Can we can we put one on top? No, we can't. There is a sapling, by the way. Oh, oh, oh! It must grow in these blocks. Hold on, let me just check that. Yes. So the sapling will grow on these blocks. There we go, and they'll just grow naturally. So that's really cool. Right, let's go and show you some of the animals that we got. We'll show you all new animals now, but that is really cool update. Right, guys, you can see we've got nine animals. Or basically, there's not nine whole animals. There's also some new stuff which I'll go through as well, like the skunks spray now. Oh my god, we got these running over here as well. They are gorgeous. Oh look. Oh. <laughs> and the birds in here. Right, let's go and do this, guys. Oh, look, we found some here. We come back here and we can actually find some. Uh, oh, they spawn in the plains as well. That's quite good. Right, uh, first up, guys, we have a grey mouse opossum. Oh, how cute is that? Oh, my God. Look at the little ears go and the tail. Grey mouse opossum. And we got a Mexican mouse opossum. <laughs> cuter oh my lord look at those look, the little nose moving as well oh my gosh oh how cute are they oh is that one naturally spawned over here oh no 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 it's not it's the little kangaroo rat right pack rat desert pack rat oh well, hopefully these won't eat each other because that's a trouble pack rat let's have a look at this guys <gasps> It's another cutie. Do we get babies? No, we don't get babies. I've remembered this. But look at the little pack rat. Oh, I just love how the ears move. Oh, wow. <laughs> right. Striped skunk, guys. I don't know where these actually spawn. <gasps> oh, my lord. Oh. We've gone for cuteness in this update, isn't there? And a spotted skunk. <gasps> Oh, sorry. Oh my word, look at those. They are special cuteness. Uh skunks as well will spray if the player is hit if they hit right. Will it spray me? Ooh, it sprayed me. Oh I'm having a cut oh dear, I'm gonna be sick. Oh my god, that is just a bit too much, guys. Oh please, please stop. Please stop. I'm not going to hit you again. See, that is good. Don't hit your animals. They are super cute though, aren't they? <laughs> right. Oh, prairie dogs. Let's get over here, guys. This is the new black-tailed prairie dog. Let's have a look. Oh, it's not what I expected. I expected like a dog rather than a rat. A prairie dog. I was expecting a dog, not like a little rabbit type thing. That's obviously what it is. I missed that one. Uh, and a Californian ground squirrel as well. But black tail. Black tailed. Yes, it is black tailed. Right. Ground squirrel. <gasps> oh, 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 look at that. Oh, how cute are they? The, the whole thing, the whole, all the updates have just gone for total cuteness, haven't they? Total cuteness, guys. Right, what's next? Oh, a Texas blind salamander. I wonder if they are in the caves. I wonder if they're in... Oh, my word. Caves down here. Oh, texture packs I'm using. I'm using the latest Faithful. Wonderful. And I love these shiny blocks. It's just so good. So let's have a look at the cave salamander. Well, I call it... Oh! Oh, can we have some more of these, please? Oh, my God, there's any water here. Yes, there is. <gasps> Do they swim? Oh, I can't tell. They might die. They live at caves. Oh, my God, they do swim. Look, they do swim. And they breathe. Oh, that is so good. Oh, they've sort of come up for air. Oh, my gosh. That is good stuff. Can we have some more of those, please? How did I get a recipe then? What did I do to get a recipe? Did I kill something? I don't know. Right. Okay. That is super cool. Uh, and a blind catfish. Okay. Blind catfish. No. Oh. They don't. Oh, they're being eaten. The blind catfish are being eaten by the salamander, I think. What 
do we reckon? So we've got one in here. Let's put a couple in here. Oh wow. <laughs> they are good. Wowza. Absolutely wowza. Well that's good. You can have a like, that's a very never thought about doing that. Making a little waterfall feature where they come in, pop down, swim around, and then they pop back up. That'd be quite good to have in the zoo. Bit naughty having them in the zoo though. But there we go. Oh, it's wonderful. Right, that is it. Red Cooper has done a marvellous update. As we saw, you will find the creatures spawning naturally. I love the fact that these creatures now start spawning in the surrounding biomes, just the desert, because it wasn't originally a desert, a desert uh, mod. But you can see the creatures are spawning here now. So again, thank you, Red Cooper, for the updates. You can download this on a Minecraft Forge. All details in the description. Uh, and also you can keep up to date with the updates as well with it. Uh, go and have a look at my previous showcases. Just look at, oh, there's some birds. Just go and have a look at my previous showcases where we've showcased all the animals. Uh, I said to Red Cooper, once we get to version, like the full version one, I'll do a full showcase again. But at the moment, we're just showing the updates. This is cute. I do like the birds. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that short video. Thank you much for watching, guys. Just take a second to go and slip that like button. Go on, go and slap it. It does me a lot of good. That's real. That's all I ask you people if you're still here watching me. Oh, I just love these everywhere. There we go. Thanks for watching and bye-bye for now.